Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm going to be unboxing my Owl Crate for the month of September, I think. Um, this is the new box. They recently rebranded to a new logo, which honestly, the logos are not that different. They're pretty similar, but I do like this new color. Well, I don't know, I'm kind of like conflicted, like the blue. It feels a little more kiddish, to be honest, but whatever. It's so cute. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and open it. Here is the box. And this month's theme was Drawing Your Secrets. Uh, I'm very excited for this book. Um, so, yeah. So, the first thing on top here is our treasure tomes pin that they've been doing this collectible item this year, every single month. Um, I'm very excited. I'm pretty sure... Uh, okay, let's see. Yeah, I love this collectible item this month, this year. So, so cute. So, here is this month's pin. It is inspired by Bowel. Um, I haven't read the book yet, but I do want to read it. Um, this is so pretty. And of course, it opens up and it's stunning. It says an act of translation is an act of betrayal, which I love. Really, really excited. This is so cute. Um, just my favorite thing that Alcree has done, to be honest. These are just beautiful, beautiful pins. And I love this one. So, so pretty. So, yeah. I really love that. The next thing here is um, some tea. Again, I'm not a tea person. Well, I want to get into drinking tea. I keep saying it every single video and I still haven't tried any of the tea that I got in. So, hopefully, I will. But... This is the Bolian Library Tea, which is English Breakfast Cream and Chamomile. Um, I have no idea. University of Oxford. Um, this is from Riddle's Tea Shop. Magic with Desire Made Real. I'll oh, create exclusive. I'm trying to. Oh, inspired by a inspired by a discovery of witches. So, yeah. Hopefully, I enjoy this tea. I really want to be like a tea person, so hopefully I would finally make some and hopefully enjoy it. Anyways, the next thing we have here is this cute little purple thing. I have no idea what it is, but it's purple and it has this beautiful like moth on it, which is really, really cute. It opens up, it has a mirror in here and like a little pocket, um, which is cute. On the back it says... I have no idea what it says, to be honest, but maybe you can read that. I have no idea what it says. Um, let's see what it's inspired by, and exactly, I'm not really sure what this is. Um, let's see, this is a lipstick case. So that's interesting, I obviously don't wear lipstick, so don't know what I would use it for. But I like, I like the design of it, at least, so... Yeah, and this is inspired by The Whispering Dark, so there's that. Again, I don't really like products like these where it's, like, obviously um, designed for, like, females, <laughs> um, but whatever. Um, yeah, th it's pretty, so there's that at least, but I just won't use it unless I come up with something else for it to be used. The next thing we have is this thing. Let's see what it is. So, it's just like a little bag, which I actually really, really like. I like the, like, Coloroid. Is that what it's called? I have no idea, but this is really, really cute. I love the simple design of just the skull and rose flower on it. I think it's really, really cute. X, I don't know. I don't know how to read, but it has, like, buttons to close the bag and stuff. And it has pockets inside, so I think it's really, really cute and really, really nice. So I probably will use this, maybe. But yeah, this is really, really cute. I actually really, really love this. I think it's nicely designed. Um, and let's see. It is inspired by Lessons in Vig Venice, Vengeance. <laughs> so that's really, really nice. Um, I think we have the last, last item here, and then we have the book. 
But the next thing we have is one of the collectible items that do in this here. I think in total there's four. So I think this might be not the last one, but the third one we got. And this is clearly inspired by the Alice 6. And this is absolutely beautiful. This is a little journal right here. I really love it. I think it's so pretty. On the front it says gods of our own universes. And on the back is the problem with knowledge is it's insoftable pronounce that a <laughs> craving but yeah this is so pretty and this one is a daughter journal but i really like this collectible that our crate is doing this year because once you fill this notebook up you're able to replace it and still use this um beautiful design so i actually really really like that i think that's really really nice and cool um but yeah i'm pretty sure we might be getting one more um i could be wrong this could be the last one. So it's the third one in our 2023 collections featuring in the universe reference. The journal will be shared to transport you to a different uh, literacy universe. This one journal pays homage to Alice Journal and Society and the Alice Six and has been designed um, by Lichen and Limestone. So yeah, it's the third one. But I think there still might be one more uh, that they will do in this series collectible before the end of the year i could be wrong though but this is absolutely stunning so i'm really really happy with that and then we have the actual book here i'm pretty sure yeah so here's the book it is a study in drowning by ava reed i'm very excited for this book um so i know this is also a little Creek book choice for this month but this is actually really really pretty um it's a cover redesign right here i think it looks really, really nice we have the spine and then the back cover in the back it says the only enemy is the sea so that's really, really pretty i really like this cover I wasn't sure how it's gonna feel about it because yeah but i do like it i think it's really, really cute because lately i haven't really been enjoying our crates designs to be honest with the books um but i think this one is just i like it but it's not my favorite um so let's go ahead and take out the dust packet on the reversal side there is a reversal dust packet they do use which is really really nice so i do like this the only problem that i have with this is it doesn't have the title on the actual spine so that's i just don't understand why because they put it on the on the cover right here so i just wish they put it on the spine but either way this is also really really pretty and it says it began it began as all things did a girl on the shore terrifying and uh, desirous so yeah that's really, really cute i do like that on the naked hardback we have the us cover which is really really pretty i'm glad this they um used the original cover somehow because I just really, really love the original cover in the US. It's stunning. I don't like the UK cover, so I'm a little worried what um, Alone Crate's version is gonna like, um, but the US cover right here is just beautiful. And on the back it says, I was a girl when he came for me, beautiful and treacherous, and I was a, cr and I was a crown of pale gold in his black hair. So that's really nice. And then we have beautiful in pages. That's really, really pretty. And then on the back, they are different, but again, very, very pretty. I really love them. Very gorgeous in pages. Um, and then we do have an inbound letter and it is signed by the author. And I really love that I'll create to do um, sign um, books and the bound in their letters um, because fairly lately this year have not been doing a lot of real signatures so i'm happy at least our pray has been doing that but yeah uh let me know your thoughts on this box overall i'm pretty happy with everything um the only thing i don't like was the lipstick case because i just won't get any use out of that but everything else i do love my favorite is um the journal here i think this is stunning and the pen of course um and the book is pretty enough i just wish it had stencil edges or something i but whatever um 
so yeah i'm happy for the most part <laughs> let me know your thoughts on this book and on the items um thank you guys for watching um make sure to like comment below subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys